feel like this is a remix of an old song. The heat is still on. It's the hottest week for the uh, planet on record. A lot of families tell us that they've been trying their best to just stay inside. However, local service technicians for AC, HVAC folks say many people have been struggling to stay cool inside too without a working AC. CBS 17's Mariah Ellis is live for us tonight in Durham after hearing from some homeowners and some crews making some repairs out there. And I know it's just hot standing there waiting to talk to me, so take it away. It is definitely hot this afternoon, too. And when it's this hot, it's hard for families not to want to turn down their AC and stay as cool as possible. We heard from Michael and son. They're service technicians who say these weeks can be very busy for them. And they say some of their technicians are working five to seven different jobs a day. When it comes to the summer heat, I don't go outside a lot. Kay Urquhart of Durham tries to avoid it as much as possible. We wait all year for summer to roll around, and then this time of year, you know, the first week of July, we're thinking, when is fall coming? I mean, we are just. North Carolina is hot. Burkett says it wasn't until the other day she noticed she had a problem. I could tell it was getting warm in the living room because that's where the issue was. <laughs> Calling a service technician from Michael and Son, Urka quickly learned the issue, a loose air duct and an easy fix. Oh, yeah. Daniel Hughes says the calls have been coming in since the weekend, most families without a working AC at all. Usually it's just, uh, I'm hot, is the, the most uh, common call. Hughes says he's been working often until midnight, responding to several emergency calls with issues ranging from clogged filters to rusted evaporator coils. So if you find the condensate drain for your house, just make sure it's got a good steady drip of water. It's a problem, Hughes says, can be avoided by a routine maintenance check every six months and by making sure your thermostat is set in the morning and consistent. Running running long hours really stresses the machinery, um, gives a, a real good workout. Because a hot home isn't always a safe or happy home. I had a friend here this morning who had a complete no AC at all yesterday, and she was miserable. This is a first world problem, but we want to be cool in our homes during this extreme heat. I also reached out to Wake County, and as of Monday, they say their Cool for Wake program has been able to help families this summer. They said as of Monday, they've been able to give out 80 fans and six AC units to give families a break. And Durham, Mariah Ellis, CBS 17 News. Definitely needed. All right, Mariah, thanks so much. Appreciate it.